Hello everyone, my name is Jatin Nagi and today we are going to discuss about Phenogreek. Please watch this video till end and if you like it, then please share and like this video and subscribe our channel for latest updates. And if you want to discuss any other topic, then please let us know in comment section or through our email. So let's get started. Phenogreek is also known as Methi in Hindi. You can refer to this image. These are the leaves of Phenogreek and these are the seeds of Phenogreek. So let's move further to some best varieties of fenugreek. First is Kasuri Methi which looks like this. You can refer to this image and Pusa which looks like this. You can refer to this image too. So let's move further to fenugreek producing countries. Afghanistan, Pakistan, India, Iran, Nepal, Argentina, Egypt, France and the largest producer in Indian states like Rajasthan, Gujarat, Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh. This is most important that Rajasthan accounts over 80% of India output of fenugreek. So let's move further to preparation and storage. Dried seeds should be lightly roasted before using. After roasting they are easily ground. So a small amount will complement many other spices but too much can be overpowering. If the seeds are required as part of curry paste they can be soaked overnight to swell and soften and easily mix with other ingredients. So this is all about preparation and storage. So let's move further to fenugreek cultivation. Fenugreek requires well-drained, good soil of medium texture and tolerated pH ranges 5.3 to 8.2. White flowers appear in early summer and develop into long, slender, yellow brown pods containing the brown seeds of methi commerce. Life zone of Methi is 18 to 27 degrees centigrade. The plant thrives in full sun on rich, well-drained soils. So this is all about cultivation. Now we are moving further to adulterants. Adulterants are the substances which are used to mix with the other substance or the product to increase its volume or other properties. So let's get started. Generally, there is not specifically, uh, specially or you can say there is not a specific adulterant of fenugreek that is methi but a lot of herbs of leguminose family are used as adulterants you can say that coriander plants are mostly used as adulterants of methi so this is how coriander looks like we have already discussed about coriander in our previous video you can view that video by clicking on i button so and this is about fenugreek so you can see that these are nearly similar, the seeds are similar, they can be added. So this is all about today's video. I hope you have learned something from this video. Please like and share this video and subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching.